Hey, in this video, I'm going to show you how to plot data in a simple way. So let me share my screen. Okay, I'm going to create a new Google Colab file. And in order to use the plotting tools, let's call this simple plots. I'm going to first import my plotting tools. So I'll put a little comment that says, import plotting tools. So the command is import. Um, this is the name of the library of plotting tools, matplotlib, and pyplot is the Python plotting tools. And I'm importing it as plt. So every time I want to call a plotting tool, I'll do plt dot and then the name of the plotting tool. So let me run that line of code. And I'll start another line of code over here. So I'm just going to create some fake data. Um, I'll just call, well, we'll have some years, say 2000, 2001, 2002, 2003. I put that in a, this list with these square brackets and the commas. And then I'm going to put um, the number of people in my household as people. So in 2000, it was five, then it went down to two, then three, then five. All right. So this is my data that I just made up that I'm going to plot. And to plot it, I'm going to go PLT to call my plotting tools and then plot. And I'm going to tell it what to plot, years on the x-axis and people on the y-axis. So let me go ahead and plot that. And there's my plot. It may gave me a line plot. If I'd rather do a scatter plot with just dots, I can instead of do PLT plot, I can do PLT scatter. And now it just plots the points. If I want to make this look a little nicer, I might want to add a title, household size, and an X axis label. So that's X label. Oh, here, nicely thought of it, had prompted me for it. So I'll call that year and a Y label. There we go. And I'll call that people. And to avoid getting that annoying little text down there, it's handy to do PLT show and that kind of like puts everything together. So let's try that. Okay. And here I have a nice scatter plot. And again, if I want a line plot instead, I want to connect the dots. Oops. I just do. Plot. That's all for now.